good morning students recently board has released the sample question paper of various subject in that they have also put up one account paper the analysis of that sample account paper based on that how you can prepare yourself well by understanding the question paper pattern it become easy for you to prepare for your exam see for the section a you need to do all the chapters except chapter 2 that is final account and chapter 3 of part 2 that is company's final account the mcqs are not going to be asked from this two chapter other than that mostly you will be having two mcq from most of the chapter so each and every mcq you have to do even this two chapter if you go through would be better because it is ask or not is a different story but for knowledge you have to do it for the section b you can understand that do all the answer in short that is the b question section questions are given of chapter number 3 4 6 and 7 that is of part 1 and of chapter 2 5 and 6 of part 2 because most of the question one liner they have asked from this chapter but again i advise every paper setter have their own blueprint i keep on saying every time and if 10 questions are there they may try to give justice to most of the chapter for section c precisely they have selected the chapter number 1 of part 1 chapter 4 and chapter 7 for chapter 2 of part Two. Here in the C section, you have to answer only four question out of six. Clear? So here you have chapter one, two, three, and uh, here the fourth one. So uh, the repeat question they have asked from the dissolution chapter and from the part two, that is debenture chapter. So like this, they are going to make. six questions four chapters six question so you have to do c section all the question of this many number of chapter again i repeat chapter 1 4 7 of part 1 and chapter 2 of part 2 you have to do all illustrations and all the exercise c section question of this particular chapters for section d you have to prepare part 1 chapter number 3 from this chapter that is goodwill they have asked two questions chapter number 7 that is what dissolution there is a possibility they will ask from dissolution instead of asking from 3 to they may ask of dissolution also chapter number 4 5 and 6 of part 2 it means that for your four mark question you have to prepare your chapter 4 5 and 6 that is analysis of financial statement your accounting ratios and analysis and cash flow statement each and every exercise d section questions you are supposed to do with illustration don't forget to do illustrations for section e very precisely you can go for the chapter number 5 of admission that is part 1 chapter 6 that is retirement of part 1 and chapter 2 that is a uh, share capital of our chapter 1 share capital that is of part 2 so here eight mark five questions will be there three you have to attempt so these are the three chapter from which the possibilities of according to the weightage 
the possibilities of only these chapters remain for 8 mark question so you have to do all the questions of exercise long question along with the illustration no bargaining for example admission if you are doing the all goodwill point related with the admission retirement also the goodwill point and in the uh, our uh, share capital chapter you have to do that is the forfeiture procedure of the shares as well as that pro rata share examples which are given that also to be done because this time we have full syllabus so don't miss out any of the illustration of these three chapters for section f you have to prepare chapter 2 of part 1 that is final account now final account question will be you may have six to seven adjustment and one or two may be internal adjustment max to max seven adjustments will be asked in your board exam paper because paper also to be done in three hours so the length also to be keep in mind so the best way of uh, revising final account chapter is that you go through all adjustment first you must know how to solve the adjustment any trial balance may be there important thing is how to handle those adjustments so every example all adjustments you have to understand twofold effects to be understood if more than twofold effects are there that also to be understood and accordingly the preparation to be done so all sums of the final account along with illustration see better in the textbook they have given quite lengthy question that much big may not possible but any selective adjustments are going to be there so adjustments understanding is more important than you do the whole example that way you have to prepare so for learning adjustment there is a very compact video including all the adjustment on my channel. Please go through it. That will help you out. Then next long question of 11 mark is chapter 3 final account of part 2. Again here very few questions are there in that chapter. All illustration and the exercise long question compulsorily you have to go through and you have to prepare. This way you can make your preparation very precise and to the point and if you become little calculative while preparing yourself you can easily score maximum marks without any particular omission or without any losing a mark in your exam. So section wise chapters are here mentioned to you according to chapter according to weightage of each section the questions are there in the exercise please do all in this way preparation become easy i hope you all must have liked the video like the video subscribe share with your friends understand the concepts and comment if you have any doubts thank you all the best